Welcome everybody here at Cooley Ranch Elementary and welcome to this empowerment that was specially made just for you. But you know what? I'm sorry I couldn't be there, but I would like all of you to know that I am doing great and my recovery is going well. But in order to do this empowerment, I did need the help of some of my very best friends. And one of them is actually here to help me. Who is that, you ask? Well, let me show you why it is. Ah! Miss Rosa, let's Hello. give her a ten finger woo. One, two, three. Woo! There we go. So let's get this empowerment started. We are going to dive right in and we are going to teach one specific skill that I know that you will be needing as you go on to your academic careers. And what I mean by that is that you are now going to be venturing into. Dun, dun, dun. middle school. <gasps> That's right. And sometimes when we're at middle school, we hear negative thoughts and things that people are putting us down, telling us we're not good enough. Well, I am here to tell you that you are. And we're, But we are going to talk about these negative thoughts, which we will refer to as your red thought. That's right, red thought. And those are our negative thoughts of what people tell us that we're not good enough and we get those ideas from. Some of them might be something like... Oh, what are those? What? Uh, are you talking about my you shoe? need some of these. <gasps> mm -hmm. These are way better. She's, uh -uh. Ew. Nope. She's now not talking about it. my shoes. Mm -mm. Oh, she went there. And as she tells me that my shoes aren't good enough, I begin to create my own red thoughts in my head and I begin to think, oh my gosh, is she right? Am I not good enough because I don't have the right shoes? And I begin to think that that's who I am and that I am not good enough and I feel bad about myself. What about that hair? Ew, what you do to it? No, not feeling it. No. Now she's telling me my hair isn't good enough. And as she tells me this, I'm a bit embarrassed. But when I go home, I start to think, oh my gosh, I need a new hairstyle. I gotta go get that fixed. She doesn't like it. And that is just upsetting to me. It's so upsetting, Miss Rosa, that I just have to leave for a second because all this negativity is really hurting my heart. It's really hurting my heart that this happens at our middle schools. So could you tell them the importance of negative self-talk and why it could be so damaging. <sighs> well, when other people tell you negative things, you start believing them. So her shoes, I talked about her shoes, talked about her hair. Now she's going to go home and start believing it. She's going to see it and she's going to be like, oh, I should change it. Maybe I need to change my color. Maybe I need to style it different just to fit in. Right? Is that, should we do that? No! Fear not, for I am here, your superhero, to get rid of those negative talk. Those rips out of here. They cannot stay. But instead, <laughs> I am going to teach you how to have a blue thought and do some positive self-talk. So when she talked about my shoes, well, you know what I say? I like my shoes, and if it wasn't for these kind of shoes, I wouldn't be able to walk. So, poof! be gone with that negative thought. Then she talked about my hair. But you know what? I dare to care what others think because I like my hair. So please don't stare if you dare. So <laughs> what we're going to do is I'm going to start telling myself when I'm able to get rid of that negative thought, I begin to tell myself I am perfect and I am good just the way I am and I'm not going to change those things for anybody. Do you agree, Miss Rosa? Yes, I agree. We turned that red thought to a blue thought. <laughs> that's right. So that's what today's empowerment is going to be about. Be your own superhero. Dun, 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 dun. That's right. That's yes. what we are here for you today. I am sorry I can't be with you, but I'm super excited because I know everything that's planned. You know we have an activity with every empowerment that we do. 
and it's going to be like that today. So I hope you enjoyed today's empowerment and learn some really good skills as you transition into middle school. So until I see you again, goodbye.